I have not purchased tartar sauce in so long because it never fails. Whenever we have fish, we either forgot to grab tartar sauce or it's gone bad and just it, Murphy's Law, all right? So I've just gotten in the habit of making my own tartar sauce whenever we're going to have fish. Tonight we're having fried fish for the first time in forever. Fried catfish, so good. So we're going to make some homemade tartar sauce. You need one cup of mayonnaise, a quarter cup of relish, one tablespoon of mustard, one teaspoon of dill. If you like it more dilly like me, do you like a teaspoon and a half? One teaspoon of onion powder, one teaspoon of lemon juice, and a quarter teaspoon of salt, a quarter teaspoon of black pepper. That is it. I like to put all this just right in the measuring cup. It makes it a lot easier. That way you can just put it in the fridge until it's dinner time and you, you have tartar sauce ready to go for everybody, for the whole family. So you just mix it all up just like this. Make sure it's mixed well and that's it. That's literally it. And the best thing about homemade is you can control what goes into it and how much of each ingredient. Like I said, I like dill, so I put a little extra dill in mine. If you don't like dill, you could omit it all together. It doesn't matter because you're making it yourself. So definitely creamy and delicious. If you get a try, let me know what you think.